Yo, what's happening guys, it's JTP7 and today I'm doing another subscribers career mode. We have Swansea against West Brom, Wolves in the League Cup, um, Chelsea and Stoke in the League. And in the West Brom game, probably the, fir the first game is probably the most easiest out of all the games i played on World Class. Um, they didn't, well, West Brom did not create a chance all game and as you can see I took the lead there from a mistake. Um, I'm trying to do this commentary by the way with Vegas a bit laggy on my um, laptop it doesn't cope well with Vegas very well so it's uh, it's difficult to commentate over but uh, I hope I'm doing okay I had a lot of long shots but that was pretty much it for the West Brom game to be honest with you if you like this video please like and fave and I hope you like my new mic um, which my mate gave me nasty weight and uh, big thanks to him so if you like uh, the sound of my voice this time and it sounds a bit better then um, go and subscribe to nasty weight who gave me this yeah, the link to his channel will be in the description. As you can see here, in the League Cup game, Ebanks Blake got in front of goal. Great run. And then he just placed it second second place in the, in the corner. So, uh, after the keeper saved it. And then I went another good run with Routledge. But he shot wide. I'm um, nearly at 1k, so thank you very much. And if you could like and fave, um, that would be brilliant. Because I want to get some more active subscribers, to be honest with you. Because recently... I don't know if it's because Modern Warfare 3 come out, but I've been getting less views ever since that game, bloody game come out. And to be honest with you, I find it a pile of shit, to be honest, this year. But anyway, um, second half I did much better. And as you see, Sinclair came really close there. And I uh, also had a corner here. And I had a, went just over the bar. Um, but I think it's here I eventually take the lead. I mean, get an equaliser. And it's a chip ball in, and it's a full volley from Graham. We're brought off the bench at half time because I've made a few changes for the League Cup game. And uh, uh, I had Leeds up front in the first half, but he didn't really do much. And uh, so I, I could have, I could have probably um, took the lead, as you can see, um, before the end of the 90 minutes. But unfortunately, I couldn't take the lead, and so it went to extra time. Um, an extra time I took the lead eventually a ball through and Dyer the substitute crossed it in uh, for Sinclair who headed it in I was hoping he'd do a um, scorpion kick or something but he didn't um, but still 2-1 in the League Cup which is good uh, it would be good if uh, for the subscribers we could uh, we could get uh, the League Cup and win it or something with Swansea. That would be quite amazing. But as you see, Wolves there miss a brilliant chance. I couldn't believe they missed that on World Class. It's just so not like the computer to miss that sort of chance. And then they got in quite a few times. They're really going for it after I took the lead. As as you would expect, really, for a League Cup game. But that was it. It ended 2-1. So we're into the next round of the League Cup, which is brilliant. And then the next game was a League game away to Chelsea. And Sinclair, former Chelsea player, got in front of goal there. And then you can decide, guys, whether this was a penalty or not. Um, Torres goes down. I think he takes a bit of a dive. And uh, Mr. Frank Lampard steps up. Swansea fans are really pissed off. Swansea players, I mean, because they don't think it's a penalty. Um, but Lampard steps up against Vaughan. And what a save from the keeper, Vaughan. Very good save. And they probably deserve that because I don't think they deserve to take the lead. And as you, we did take the lead ourselves, Terry cleared up the pitch. He came back down. And Sinclair smashes it in. So uh, Terry Blooper there. I don't know what the hell, what the hell he was doing there. Hope you like a new mic, by the way. Um, if put in the comments if you do or not. And uh, I think we're now at 45 minutes. Chelsea created a few chances, but second half they really came alive. The first half I was quite comfortable with them, but second half I couldn't cope. And uh, they took the lead um, quite soon. I think Jobber had a chance there which was saved. Um, but then they did take the lead from this corner kick, a bad defending, and uh, Drogba put it in to the goal. And then next, it's uh, another goal. It's just suddenly they were just destroying my defence, was nowhere. Against Chelsea, I found it very difficult and world class with Swansea. And my two defenders are in the 70s, you know. So it was very difficult. It's not that I'm bad or anything. Um, but against world class it's difficult to do skills and stuff and then Torres made it 3-1 and uh, it pretty much was all over by then so uh, that wasn't good 
The next game was against home at home against Stoke, who are very um, big team and very strong, good in the air, and and you know very difficult to get past. But I did create a good chance, which somehow the keeper saved, and uh, that was probably the best chance of the game, if I'm being honest. Um, I had a few long range shots in this game, but I just couldn't get clear cut chances apart from that volley, and so that game ended nil nil, unfortunately. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Um, probably shouldn't have tramped. This. I probably should have tramped this goal here as you're watching. Um, but anyway, thanks for watching this video, guys. Um, sub make sure you subscribe, like, fave, etc. And as you can see in the league table at the moment, we are tenth, and we are four points off fifth place. It's Europa Cup. So hopefully we might be able to get there. I'm not sure, but I think tenth tenth place is good. So I'll see you in a bit guys, uh, thanks for watching.